If you're looking for a far-out pleasure car that's all your own, not only original but unique, then you should come to Italy and consider this one. Nobody else in the world has a model that's anything like it. It's not only the undulating silhouette and the doors that lift up like wings. This is the only lie-down sports car in the world. You combine the thrills of speed at 180 miles an hour with the luxury of lying down while you drive, reclining on crimson velvet with an easy head prop so that you can see through the windshield. Here in this country of prestigious sports cars, a young American, a mechanical whiz and designer from San Francisco, Tom Mead, 31 years old, has come to challenge the glamorous big names, Ferrari, Maserati, Lamborghini, with some remarkable creations of his own, made in his workshop here in Modena. He has already won remarkable recognition. Mead has received the supreme accolade of the Italian automotive world. He's the only American ever invited and sponsored as an exhibitor in Italy's motor pantheon, the Turin Auto Show. Since Meade was 12 years old, he's given thousands and thousands of hours to his ruling passion, the study of technical design. He came to Italy 10 years ago, set up experimental shop, and began putting together imaginative combinations of parts from various Italian models. The lie-down car is a completely original product, the whole car, body and chassis, made by him and his Italian workers. Everything except the Ferrari engine and the gear shift. And he's named it after himself. It's the Tomassima, and its emblem is a heraldic beast, a goat rampant.
the track at the Modena Autodrome, it's an aerodynamic streak of volcano red aluminum, low slung and road hugging. It is not a race car. It's just made to look and handle like one and is tested as a racer on the track. It's a town sports car, Meade says, ready for the street or a sumptuous pleasure car for the Grand Tour meeting all the highway regulations. The reason for making it a lie-down job was twofold. First, just the idea of luxuriously lying down. Secondly, aerodynamics. The low profile cuts air resistance. At a critical speed, the nose rises. And that's the reason for the airfoils on the front fenders to keep it straight and level. Mead recumbent at the wheel. The ignition is just above his head. The fittings are plush and opulent. This particular engine is a Ferrari V12, a uh, three liter, and uh, it's a, an X racing engine that's been completely detuned uh, for street use. The plan for this highly specialized car, how does the market look? Mm -hmm. The market is very good for such a car, and uh, especially because the big factories uh, don't make one-off cars like this and really couldn't afford to. Uh, I find that the market is really wide open. It's something that no one has ever done before, and uh, I think I'm probably the first to uh, uh, present uh, one one-of-a-kind cars. One of a kind. Well, now, this is a unique car. Yes. Are you ever going to build another one exactly like it? No. Uh, the next car uh, that I build, for example, will be rear-engined and will be similar in idea, but of course much different in shape and uh, uh, much wider. It'll be quite a bit different, actually. Have you sold this car yet? Uh, this car, I have many people interested in buying it, but however, I've uh, held the car for advertising purposes and for auto shows and so forth, of which uh, I've been invited all over Europe for. So. You've got the buyer. Well, I've got many buyers. Uh, at the moment, I, I don't want to sell the car until I'm finished with it, you know. What's the price? Uh, the price of this one is $18,000. Everybody who is car mad, and in Italy that's practically everyone, goes mad about the Tomassima. Men, boys, women, gather, gape, peer, and comment. The glamour car that is all curves. Mead's dream is to turn out 12 cars a year, each car in production for five or six months, each one different, with varying refinements or radical alterations of design. Lying down or sitting up as you choose. Designed to your taste, fitted to your height, your measurements, the length of your legs. Every car unique. And every car bearing his inscription, Tom Mead of Modena. An exotic creation, and for Tom Mead, a passionate gamble. Winston Burdett, CBS News, Modena.